everyone. Muchas gracias por... Why am I doing in Spanish? Anyways, thank you everyone for clicking this video. Um, I hope you enjoy this video as much as I did filming it. It's a video that's basically what's in my purse and what's in my bag video and my everyday school basis. Most of them, right? Alright, thank y'all so much and I hope you enjoy this video. Hey everyone, so I'm going to start with my book bag first. Um, so usually all the products I have in here are from Target. Most of them. Some of them. Most of them. Majority of them are from Target. So hopefully I get sponsored by Target one day. Hopefully like in a few years. <laughs> okay, so this is my mochila. Um, I love this book bag so much. I got it probably three weeks ago. So it's not the one I actually started off the semester with. So what happened was I was supposed to go. I, I did go to this one trip outside of the country for a spring break and I really needed a book bag right and I told my mom dude I need to go buy a book bag I don't know if I should buy a purse or a book like a big purse put your stuff in or an actual book bag so I was at Target right there just looking and looking well okay I couldn't find anything I found a few but they look very señorada so I was like this is too much for me I, I just don't like it at all so much because it's very spacious and you can put your entire body in here basically I love it I really do so in the front it has one pocket, small pocket, in the back it has another small pocket. So we're gonna start with the small pockets first and then we're gonna lead ourselves into here, okay? Okay, so the first thing is the quality, like the book bag is so está bien um fuerza. It's very thick and I just love it so much because knowing me I carry a lot of things at once sometimes and it's a lot. Okay, so my front pocket has my first aid kit, which is simply just um band-aids. Um, alcohol wipes, small little band-aids, and my gauze. So I'm basically like a little wannabe doctor at this point in life, right? <laughs> so that's that. And then I have my volunteer ID right here. So I do volunteer at a hospital whenever I can. And then I have my deodorant right here. Also from Target. I have pomada la campana. This is my go-to crema usually because my hands do get extremely dry. Like, it's a little bit embarrassing. Well, I don't, honestly don't care. My hands do get extremely dry, especially, so it's usually my my right hand. <laughs> it gets extremely dry. I don't know, my skin just gets really dry on this side whenever I'm very, very stressed, and that's usually around school time. For this, I have another small little pocket, and this is where I have my emergency pads, right? So all sizes of pads are in here for my friends. I have four of them. I have three friends, no, four friends. So this folder right here is my biology folder. It's green for earth and life. And this is where I keep all my freaking worksheets and activities that my teacher makes me do. And my little, I get my little answers wrong on this quiz, but I did quest correction, so that should help. Oh yeah, so everything inside here is not exactly what I take every single day because obviously in college, there's some days that you don't have class every day. So I know Mondays and Wednesdays have, for example, my biology class and my lab on Wednesdays and I have my Tuesdays and Thursdays at work and I have chemistry, right? So it's like different days in calculus throughout the entire week, right? So for tutoring, I, so I tutor. So that's my job. I, I do work study and I'm a tutor for general chemistry one. So I take these two things. So this big folder is where I keep everything, right? My electronegativity table. Um, what else do I take? Okay, my periodic table right here so you have a lifesaver and like any worksheets my sketchbook i don't draw i have my chemistry notes in here so it's just a bunch of chemistry notes and this is where i work with the students solves with them right here just converting moles to grams and lewis structures and all of that i forgot his number you know general chemistry one stuff this is the notebook that most students with lab have to take in my school so it's recommended to basically buy two of them like for example i'm taking two classes with lab right i'm taking biology i'm taking chemistry each notebook is a little bit pricey it's about probably 60 dollars each i save myself some coins so i divide it three so the one half is biology and the other half is chemistry because it's a lot right <laughs> um so basically for this number pre-labs in here pre-labs are basically like you read the lab that you have to do and just summarize it in your own words and just spread down the steps. I think any of your coins, I don't know why they want it. It's just pointless. But hopefully my school doesn't know that. And then right here I have my lab manual, right? Where my lab manual is, it's basically where the 
lab the instructions of the labs and the librarian do that that certain day this is where i have all my lab my pre-labs and my post labs are in this notebook six it was 6.99 and i love the front because it says every morning we're born again what we do today is what matters most i saw this journal notebook so on top it says drink water right here's a quote and then right here's my little to-do list like eat healthy exercise drink seven teas a day whatever and then my little morning routine is on right here, like my times and then the things I have to eat and the exercise I have to do is in the bottom. And right here, I plan on doing a little journal, like how my day went. And then in the back, I will be, I did journal like how many calories I burned. So yesterday I worked out in my treadmill and I burned 610 calories. My distance was four miles, time, an hour. And then like, like I do use it um when, it's, especially when it's raining. So when it rains, you know, you know how usually the clothes gets... I think the word is damp or moist. I think it's damp. But basically, umedo. Like, your clothes gets umeda. So, you should put some of this because I don't like the smell of it. So, that's that. And then I have my deodorant in here. I probably should put it somewhere more nice. And then I have my crema. This crema, I bought it in Mexico. Se llama crema para misil. And it's good. It's also for my skin. So, like, if you're, like, struggling from any... But right now my skin is fine at this point, right? Because I've been putting this crema on. Any clubs or activities or whatever I'm doing with my life is in here. And I love this folder so much. It's my future basically right here, right? And then I have this folder. I think this is my chemistry folder. Yep, it's my chemistry folder. I'm going to take off my syllabus. I'm sorry. It smells like my school name. So this is my chemistry folder. And this is my little worksheet. So we do get little worksheets like these to do and oh yeah this is my little laptop case that i use i usually put my ipad in there too but i don't really use my ipad i do use my ipad a lot but not as much as my laptop then i have my cute little pouch right here this is a little stethoscope that my very nice classmate gave me one day it will always like be resonating with me because i'm just like people don't people don't even know you how sweet and nice they are to you like oh my god my heart melts in pieces right and it's like beautiful because we all have like one dream obviously to get us into medical school even though the dream is like so far away from now. Yeah, we all one day will, right? Okay, so then these are my pants from high school. This really, uh, the first half comes from Mexico. The other half comes from Target. Then right here, I have these really cool, cute pants. I also bought a Target. I don't really use them, but they're so cute and cool. Right here, I have my highlighters. I don't really use cute little skinny one, you know, but it's thick. So, whatever. Then I have my calculator. I love this. And then I have my stapler. Stapler? Stapler? I don't know. Then I have my pencils. So I carry mechanical pencils most of the time. I don't really use pencils so much, but I carry them. And then I have my number two pencil in case of an exam. Or like a bubble in Scantron. Okay, and my purse right here. I got it from H&M. Not in this country. I got it in a different country. I got it in Mexico. Um, I, I think my sister took me to this one place called Andares. It's a mall in Guadalajara. I don't know. But I got it from there. It's super cute and spacious. It's very light and it's very fragile, you know? So I have to be very careful with the things I put in here. So this is something I would take to school, actually, you know? Because I'm a commuter and when you commute three hours every day, it's just pretty tough to take the entire room when you don't need your entire room. But I feel like I do need my entire room, right? So these are just like the things I usually do take on a daily to school. So first thing is my oatmeal. I do take a box of oatmeal. For my lunch right so i usually put where's my little pot so right here i take these two to school you know this is where i keep so right here is usually my fruit that and right here's my oatmeal for breakfast in the morning or for lunch sometimes i don't know that's about breakfast so i do these two okay and then i also take okay and then i also have this little purse right here and this is where i basically Put in my hand sanitizer, my little crema, more little cremas right here. Or um, my little ligas for my hair. Or the scrunchie. I take the scrunchie too, but honestly it's pointless because I don't like scrunchies. Like, I don't like the way they look on me. I don't like myself in a ponytail, that's a good thing, right? Then I have my beads here for when I work out. I'm going to put them on to demonstrate. <laughs> okay, so yeah, I have my beads. Like, this is where I carry them. And then I do, okay, I'm not so religious, but like, you know, when it, there's hard times, look, when you, okay, basically for me, since I am a commuter, I see a lot of things every day. I, say, I take the bus and the train, right? And 
I swear, like, there's people who cry in the bus, like me, or, like, people who cry on the train. Everyone has a hard day, right? And for me, it's just very important to carry something that reminds me, hey, like, you're here for a reason, and it's okay, we're gonna be fine. And I do take my little, they're not Bibles, but they're basically a, um, like, readings from the Bible, I guess you can say. So I carry this one that mom gave me, and it's just things that you should take, should read day by day. And then I also take this one, it's like to read the actual rosary. And it's good, honestly, it does calm me down a bit. Before an exam or a quiz, I just go over it really quick, it, like quickly and just read some of it. Or just like every day, honestly. <laughs> like my first thing I usually do is take on my little books and just read my very first prayer of the day or something, you know? Um, but since I forget I have that here, but dude, when I cry, like after a hard day, I pop it out. I'm like, dude, it's been such a long day. And I cry even more when I read it, so I don't know. Then I have my little spray right here. I got this from Pink. It's Fresh and Clean Mist. It's Bright Apple and Campus Life. So literally, sis, me, 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 me. It smells so good, right? It's like, get fresh with me. Springtime, fresh laundry, and bright skies. New day, new goals. It's a me thing. It's still 2020 thing, right? Okay. I carry, I put these on for lab. I don't like how they look, but yeah, they're for lab. And then I have my lab. Okay, and then I have my lab coat right here. My cute little lab coat. And there's an N right there. I do not go to the school, but I held something here before at the school, you know? Um, and to keep yourself hydrated, you just have to drink water every day. I'm being serious. Like, this isn't even like a weight loss thing or anything. Like, you just have to drink water. People who drink soda, I respect you and I love you. I really do. But drink at least one freaking glass of water a day, dude. You know? Yeah. And it was four bucks at Starbucks. Stay yourself hydrated, sis, because you need to. It's not a choice. But you need to get yourself hydrated, okay? Thank you everyone so much for watching. I truly appreciate your time and your patience. You guys have no idea how grateful I am for all of you. Um, well, like 80 views I have. <laughs> Thank you so much everyone for watching though. Um, please subscribe and like my channel. Like, I don't know how big I want to grow, but you know, whatever God's will is, I'm very excited for everything. And thank you guys all so much.